Hey guys, this is IPB guy. I'm gonna be showing you how to set up your own form um, using your own client and whatnot. Um, so we're gonna be using FileZilla for this tutorial. Um, it's the best open source file or FTP client in my opinion and most opinions. Um, so you want to set up a web um, a server with triple zero webhost.com, which will be in the description. Uh, validate your email, all the good stuff, and then you want to go to list accounts. Go to cPanel. Go down to uh, FTP, view FTP def details, copy this right there, copy this, uh, it's loading slow, use your name under there, type in your password, put port 21, quick connect, alright, now you want to go to public un underscore HTML, you can delete all that if you'd like. Now I'm just gonna show you. I don't have it on this computer because I did this all my. I have all my IPv stuff on my laptop usually. But um, so open this raw up here. Make sure I put the right one. Yeah. All right. Extract to desktop. IPB. Uh, I believe this is 3.2.3, and it's a retail version. So I'm just going to extract it into there. Alright. Yeah, and I still have not gotten a validation email. Um, I was trying to get one for... Um, I created an entire different triple zero web host that actually had IPB guys. The name is a web, you know, website. But it, uh, of course, failed on me. Uh, you guys should check out the site, EliteTechGaming.com. There's a lot of nice things on it. Uh, I'm just saying this while it's extracting. Yeah, it's a pretty good site. Okay, it's done extracting now. So, I do not know why this shit keeps on popping up. Alright, 2.3, going to upload. Copy all of this. Go to this and make sure you're in public underscore HTML. Now it's going to upload all these files, and uh, I'm going to pause while it's doing it, so yeah, I'll be right Alright guys, it literally just now got done, so um, it's done uploading, so I'm going to go to this website, and uh, you just want to make sure everything passed, which it did, good, good, yes, yes. I agree, boom. Yep. You don't need that. Um now you wanna go to your um to your SQL host. Mm -hmm. So we just go down to my SQL create oh I already have mine created. Um forgot. So just create it and then that's what you're gonna use. And uh your MySQL host is this, so put that there. Database name is this, put that there. Also it'll be your username. I believe yeah. And just type in your password you used. Um now your prefix you can just put whatever I'm gonna put the tech pit alright and um, this I need to change alright now you're gonna create your ACP um, account ah, typed in the wrong thing uh, Start installation. Um, so you can just click here. If not forwarded every single time, and it'll go faster because um, it installs pretty much instantly. It just basically goes through and goes through and checks every um, everything you know. So I'm just gonna click here. Not f if not forwarded every two seconds because of uh, that way we can get it done faster. So. Over here it shows you the steps. Um yeah. So Ah, there's a problem. 
Not a problem with IPv4, but rather your SQL server. Please contact your host and uh, okay. So I'm just gonna go back and do it again. And there you go. You see it's working. So if that happens to you guys, just uh, press back and then go back and start doing this again. And as long as it didn't put in too big of an error, it'll automatically just fix itself. So. Mm-hmm. All right, all right. And there you go. There is your new forum, guys. Now you just want to sign in with your admin account. Oh. That was good. Uh, you want to click admin CP or admin control panel. Alright, and uh, now you have all this.